Hello, hello everybody, this is Bill Murphy here with MMORPG.com, and you're looking at Beast and Jubilee in Marvel Heroes. Uh, he just came out today. Beast is the brand new playable hero in Marvel Heroes. Um, that's me running around here. He's wearing his, uh, oh geez, what is this one called? Um, his Astonishing X-Men costume. Um, and Jubilee is the brand new team-up character as well. Uh, we pre-purchased these myself so that I could uh, I could play them on launch day because Beast is my all-time favorite X-Men. Uh, even before he was blue, <laughs> I liked him, although I'm not that quite that old. It's just the, the first comic books I ever read were the, like, the original X-Men when he was just a, a dude that was hairy with big feet and big hands. Um, and Jubilee, of course, his best friend from the X-Men Academy, um, is, is, is the new team-up character. You have to buy them separately. Of course, you can try out Beast. Uh, for free up to level 10 um, and he's got he's got quite a few different powers uh, oh, here. Hank, let's take a look doot, doot, doot. okay so um, his traits are brains and muscle obviously he's got intelligence and strength as his traits uh, momentum is his mana you you gain um, ability to use your skills by moving around you can notice the little blue bar down there as I'm walking around here yep see it's going up and if you stop moving too long, it actually starts to go down. So one of the cool things about Beast uh, that makes him fun to play is you have to be moving. His movement power actually I'm does damage. Um, but it's interesting, you, you'll probably have to get some talents and stuff like that later to really flesh him out because with the new movement power limitations that they put uh, on characters with the Mega Patch that just came out, it's interesting because you have to wait. Essentially, you know, there's like three seconds of cooldown between each one. But that's okay because there are other, there should be hopefully other movement powers. Um, style, he's also got Bestial Beatdown, which I think is pretty sweet. <laughs> Does a lot of damage over six hits. Um, you have the Barrier Gadget. You can place this pretty much anywhere, and it creates a barrier where all projectiles are uh, reflected 100% chance, like that one. Um, and then the Savage Somersault. This is pretty sweet. So, uh, yeah. Just pretty cool. Little power there. Um, the Electro Catalyst is a stun. It stuns everybody around you and does damage at the same time. Uh, it works really, really well uh, against robots. Oh, here. I need to generate some movement power. This is really cool. The Grappling Hook Slam. Pick a spot that you want to attack and then... Whoop, does a massive amount of damage that's like your first really strong skill uh, and then your your main skill that uh, you'll be using a lot of is a channeling skill called uh, bestial rage there you go, there you go. basically break dances <laughs> you can't how do you how can you not love that it doesn't require any momentum you can just constantly use it Let me show you how it's and then of course his regular attack and he can his movement power, pretty creepy little crawl there. Yeah, so he's really beastly. Let's go. Uh, let's go take out some trash here. I'm only uh, what am I? Level 13 with him. See, castle, you kill for vengeance. I oh. do it for profit. Interesting. I'm not sure where that came from. Here, let's use mine. There we go. All right. It's always fun when you get something you can actually use randomly. Okay. Anyway. I'm supposed to talk to Lieutenant Higgins. Higgins. Oh my Hell's Kitchen South, is that what it is? Yeah, I think that's the one. Nope, that's me. <laughs> Hell's Kitchen North? Yeah, that's the one. All right, let's uh, let's kill some stuff, and we'll see how it goes. You can kind of see him in action. Movement power's nice. The only downside, of course, is that he doesn't have a lot of uh, you know he can't go over a bunch of stuff like flight powers or Spidey or anything like that. There we go. The Rather muscle. than money or objects, give me truth. And of course, Jubilee makes short work of just about everybody, too. She's a great team up so far. Oh, 
obviously this is on normal mode this isn't hard um i usually don't play hard until i get uh some more gear that the guys actually you know higher levels and stuff like that probably over 30 or over 40 once the talents come into play but um he does quite a bit of damage he just tears through everything oh yeah shocker Yet another mutation. <laughs> ah, beast. Into the band and subway. We'll go uh, take out Shocker. Oh, so that's just a great skill. His movement power is really good for attacks, too. <clears throat> Can't forget the forgotten station anytime you're in the subway. Let's build up our energy here. That'll do it. squander this fortune. Where is my fortune? Oh yeah, it's down there. Does it, can he run off cliffs? Oh, he can't. That's always a bummer. The best movement powers, obviously, the ones that like let you go over buildings and over short things like that. That's why I like Rocket Raccoon so much. Okay. Trust Here we go. Me, a little team up never hurt anybody. That's true. I really can't wait till Jubilee. She's gonna be just noise. So what do you guys think of Beast so far? I mean, just watching me play the early levels here uh, is not necessarily an indicator of how good he is in the end game or anything like that, but I think he's actually quite powerful. I mean, a lot of the melee characters, uh, especially like Wolverine, kind of got put in a bad spot after the Mega Patch. Um, the biggest update ever. But I really like this one. Oh, 
rather than money or objects, give me truth. <laughs> it's like they had Frazier himself doing it. Okay, before we go we get Shocker here, let's see what we have. So we have the Frenzied Lunge. I like that. Maybe we replace our defense there. Defense might come in handy, but eh, so will that. Man, I did not sign up for this. <laughs> All right, let's take down the shocker. Time to shake this place down. That does not look like Jamie Foxx at all. Run away. That oh, that comes in handy. Yeah, that was that was pretty badass actually. Good job, Beast. Well, there's no obligation to change your wicked ways. It couldn't hurt. It always always nice. Getting upgrades and everything like that. Just got the call from Professor X. Here to help. I'm gonna put you in the ground. <laughs> I could plop, I could like play this all night, no problem. And sit here and just make you guys watch me play it. But um, that's not what I'm about. I was actually just trying to show you some of the cool new skills that Beast has. And I hope you enjoyed a quick look. Uh, I, ho I hope uh, that maybe I've reminded you just how good Marvel's Heroes is. Um, especially for a free to play action RPG MMO. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Um, I know not everybody really enjoys the fact that you're playing, you know, multiples of the, every character and you know you can see like 13 beasts running around but they you know they they retcon that into the story so you can actually say oh yeah that's there's there's a whole sort of cosmic space magic happening and that's why uh yeah it's, it's a cop out but it's fun that's all that really matters is that a game's fun so this has been beast and obviously his team up jubilee uh just out today for marvel heroes um you can try beast up until level 10 but you can't try jubilee she's a team up you have to buy i think for 450 g's uh i think beast himself let's take a look beast is 600 maybe he's owned so i can't tell oh he's probably like 900 right up there with these other guys so um yeah Go ahead, take a look, go play some uh, Marvel Heroes and take a look at the new patch that changed everything with the talents and traits and the new skill system, the new Eternity, or the new Infinity system. Uh, it, it's really a lot of fun these days. Uh, there's a whole bunch of loot everywhere. It's really easy to level up everybody and, and enjoy yourself. And there's uh, more to the end game now than there ever has been before. So I definitely recommend it. And plus, who knows, maybe we'll get some news about those long rumored console editions coming up soon. Uh, I'm Bill Murphy. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Facebook, all that stuff at MMORPG.com without the dot. Have a good night. Make sure to level up your MMO knowledge by visiting MMORPG.com, subscribing to our YouTube channel, and by following us on social media. To catch up on the week's biggest MMO news, watch our latest MMO FTW. And to see if there's a better MMO out there for you, watch one of our latest First Impressions videos. Thanks for watching.